Hey there, money maestros. Welcome to Finance Insights Voice. I'm your anonymous guide, ready to take you on a whirlwind journey through the wild and wonderful world of personal finance. Are you ready to laugh your assets off? Because today, we're tackling a topic many find about as enjoyable as a root canal, budgeting. But hold on to your calculators because we're adding a twist. We're going to find the fun in finance, the comedy in cash flow, and the hilarity in hard numbers. Yes, my friends, we're diving headfirst into the laugh out loud world of budgeting. So buckle up because we're about to turn the fear of finance into a festival of fun. And remember, in the world of finance insights voice, budgeting isn't a chore, it's a comedy sketch. Picture this, your wallet and your sense of humor in a warm embrace. First up, the budget dance. Now don't worry, no actual dancing skills required unless you count the two-step you do when you check your bank account. Budgeting is a lot like a dance floor. Each expense is a dance partner, all vying for your attention. Some are flashy and full of energy, like that new smartphone you've been eyeing. Others like rent and utilities are more reliable but can step on your toes if you're not careful. And then there's the wild card, the unexpected expenses. They're the breakdancers of the budget dance popping up out of nowhere and throwing your rhythm off. But here's the thing, with the right planning, you can keep up with the beat. So, let's twist, twirl, and tango our way through our budget. Groceries, rent, utilities, they all want their moment in the spotlight. And with our savvy moves, we're going to give it to them. Now let's talk savings. Picture this, you're at a party, the music is pumping and you spot your future self across the room. You could ignore them, sure, but wouldn't you rather saunter over and give them a high five? That's what savings are all about, folks. It's not about denying yourself that extra slice of pizza or that shiny new gadget. It's about getting chummy with future you. Think of it as throwing a little party for yourself in the future. And who doesn't love a good party, right? It's like saying to your future self, Hey, I got you, buddy. This is for that rainy day when you want to buy a boat or take a sabbatical to write the next great American novel. So yes, saving money might seem like a chore, but when you think about it, it's just a way to high-five your future self. And let's be honest. Who doesn't want a high five from future you? Time for the investing comedy show. Now, we all know that investing isn't a laughing matter, but that doesn't mean we can't have a little fun with it, right? Think of investing like telling a joke, timing is everything. You wouldn't deliver the punchline before the setup, would you? Similarly, you wouldn't want to put your money into a stock just as it's about to tank. So let's dive into the world of dividends. Imagine dividends as the punchline of your investment joke. The buildup is all about the capital gains, but the punchline? That's the dividend, the sweet reward for your patience. Then there's the plot twist, market volatility. It's like a surprise ending in a comedy skit. Just when you think you've got the market figured out, it throws you for a loop. So come on, grab your popcorn and buckle up. Get ready for a roller coaster of laughs and financial insights. Who here wants to be debt free? Oh, I see those invisible hands shooting up. Picture this. Your debt is a pesky heckler at your comedy show. You're on stage, spotlight on you, and you say, hey debt, why don't you make like a tree and leave? And just like that, you're giving debt the comedic boot. It's not just about paying off loans, folks, it's about delivering that punchline with a smile. Spoiler alert, the boot is a clown shoe. And there you have it. Budgeting, savings, investing, and debt-free living, all served with a side of laughter. We've tangoed with money, high-fived our future selves, chuckled at investments, and kicked debt with a clown shoe. If this journey through the fun side of finance tickled your funny bone, then don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe for more comedic insights into the world of money, and share this laughter therapy with your fellow finance aficionados. Until next time, stay financially fabulous.